Oh my gosh. I don't even look like myself, so y'all probably really don't know who this is because I don't have any makeup on. But clearly haven't made a video in probably a year now, which is insane. But I mean, I think we've all realized that I suck at this. Today I decided that I would vlog. Sorry that I look so rash at starting out vlog, but I was curling my hair and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to vlog and maybe this would be good content. So if you don't know, I have extensions and they're normally like way down. But uh, I'm getting new hair soon. I get new hair like around my birthday every year just so it's fresh for like a new year. I don't know why I just do that. So this hair was getting like a little bit like thin and ratty on the ends. So I just chopped it to like the length of my normal hair but kept the extensions because obviously like I like them for thickness and I don't think I'll ever not have extensions now even if my hair was as long as I wanted it to be. And I'm really, I'm really liking it. I feel like it looks so natural because of this being like the length of what my hair is now. And they just blend so good. I'm sorry for the ratchet way that I have this pinned up right now. But, um, yeah, I don't have anything like crazy planned today. I, I'm going to go to the grocery store and get some snacks or something because we're going to the river tomorrow. And also my mom just had, uh, some like surgeries done. So she is out for the count and um she's good by the way and uh i'm just going to get some things that will the house needs also like we're out of sugar we're out of vegetable like literally basic boring things but yeah i'm just curling my hair a lot of people ask me how i curl my hair i do have a video like an igtv video of how i curl it when it's super long but that's not really how i curl it anymore it pretty much is like the basis of it and whatnot but it's not exactly the same so pretty much I curl it how every other person curls their hair started curling my hair like this because I'm obsessed with hair by Chrissy and if you don't know me like follow me on Instagram then you don't know that I actually went to cosmetology school and I do hair I actually my first week in a salon is next Tuesday so I am super excited I just did this one wrong because I was talking. Anyway, so yeah, going back to the topic of me being done with school, that was kind of like a lot of the reason that YouTube was kind of put on the back burner for me because to be real, I started cosmetology my senior year of high school, but I was only part time. I could only go one day a week and it was obviously after school from four o'clock to 10 o'clock at night. And normally I went to Shelton State Community College, if anybody was wondering. It did take me longer to complete, obviously, because I was only there one to two days a week so anyways normally you go two days a week but I was in high school so they only let me go one day a week so one semester actually took me the length of two semesters because they only let me go one day a week so that was the first year while I was in high school and then after that I took the summer off because I was like this is my last summer whatever didn't end up being my last summer because I didn't take cosmetology school seriously and honestly like g hair school is from what everybody tells me, is nothing like actually working in a salon. And I think that's why I didn't like it so much. Like, I honestly started to question, like, if I even wanted to do hair. So, I had no motivation to actually, like, finish school and get into the salon because it just wasn't what I thought it was going to be. And um, then I started doing, like, family and friends and stuff. And it did get more fun, like, once I could actually do real people. And I know that that's any type of um, degree that you've got to go through things that you're not even going to use. So long story short, it took me forever to finish cosmetology school. And that was always something that I would pick up my camera and I would be like, dang, like it really, it just feels wrong to be videoing or like YouTubing. What am I saying? Like, I don't even know the terms anymore. Apparently it felt wrong to like vlog when I should have been doing schoolwork and stuff like that. Like that's just how my brain works. Like I feel like I'm so like all over the place about things. And then I, ugh. Jesus, this is like the first time I've talked all day today, so sorry about my voice. Yeah, pretty much I would just make myself feel guilty for like not doing my school stuff and actually doing fun things. But now that I'm done with school, I mean, I say that, but like I'm going to start work. So hopefully I can do it all. I mean, I still have tempted and all that too. So it's just a lot that I've put on my plate, but like I'm a th the type of person that gets bored very easily. So, like, I like to have a lot of things going on. Just so that way, like, I'm not getting burnt out in, like, one area too much. And, but I also am terrible at managing my time. So, it really doesn't work together. 
I hope some of y'all like can relate to that or any of this because I've literally like felt like so dumb at the fact that it took me that long and also that like I really had no idea what I wanted to do like I've always loved YouTube and I've always loved um tempted since we started it and all that but then I also do want to be able to do hair and makeup because that was kind of like the whole reason I started my YouTube is because I've always enjoyed that but I'm really glad that I did just stick through it I mean my parents were never gonna let me quit but I'm glad that I actually am gonna work in a salon and stuff and I didn't just finish school and say okay I'm not doing this anymore because once I got to the end of it I really do enjoy it yeah basically I'm working in a salon Tuesday through Saturday Sundays and Mondays will be my off day. So Mondays will be like pretty much like 100% tempted days because all the other days that I'm at the salon, like I'll come home and like I'll try to like I'll do orders and stuff, but it's not going to be as much like media content from me. Hopefully um, me and Bailey can get on a schedule to where she's doing a lot of that when I'm at the salon. I've literally been babbling for eight minutes. I felt like I just needed to like check in with y'all and like get you back up to date of where we are and stuff okay so here's the finished hair makeup and outfit i know i look like a completely different person from the last clip but that's me all right so outfit of the day uh necklaces a lot of my jewelry i get when we go to market and it's just thing like cash and carry things so it's hard for me to say all of my earrings are either from claire's or francesca's or obviously this one's from the tattoo place these are Buddha bands or Buddha girl bands. I don't know. I like them because like they don't make a lot of noise. And then rings are either Pandora or these are two fake Cartier rings that I've had since I was 16. And then this one, a girl named Stormy made for me. She made me a bunch of them and they're really cute. I like this one a lot. Top is from Tempted, but we don't have it anymore. Free People shorts, really dirty Air Force Ones. So yeah, here's the outfit all together. I really am liking my hair this length. Okay, I have not put up this camera tripod in a long time and I don't, I hope that you can hear me. My air, it's just weird. My whole car setup is just weird. I look really orange. Hopefully I don't look like that. Actually, I'm not going to vlog with my camera up there for the whole time because my, I literally have fishbowl windows because, so people would be able to see that I was recording myself driving, which maybe I shouldn't care, but I do. Luckily I cleaned up my car two days ago because this car has zero freaking room in the trunk or anywhere so there's still some stuff back there but surely I'm not getting too much okay like this this is jingling and I know that y'all can hear it so I'm gonna try to fix that anyways yeah this is why my car is always disgustingly dirty because we live on a dirt road I really don't know like I have a microphone I don't know how people don't get the background noise in their cars I wonder what this looks like from somebody else's view like outside of my car if people are even paying attention okay I'm gonna take it down and um I will talk to y'all later okay so I got the drink this is probably about the freaking fall when I do this Ugh. come on now stand up stand on your own look at how that looks delicious and not nutritious but delicious forever oh my god y'all we're dying we're dying okay I gotta go Okay, we made it. We didn't die. We are at Sam's. I freaking love Sam's. I got my drink to mix. All is right in the world now, except for the fact that I need to eat something and that my arms are jiggly. But um, we'll save that to fix for another day. All right, so I'm just procrastinating going in. I need to get a snack. Oh my God, I forget. Sam's has their little deli. Y'all, I love junk food. It is freaking hot, y'all. And it was freaking hot in Sam's. Sorry I didn't record anything. I was on FaceTime with my sisters the whole time because whenever I see, like, things in there, like clothes and stuff. Oh, God. Y'all, my car talks to me. Um, <laughs> but whenever... Oops, sorry. Sorry about that. Let me just let me just get situated. Sorry, y'all. We're just going to deal with this angle for a second. But I'm going to call my sister and see if she's coming here to meet me. And, um, yeah, maybe I'll vlog in there. I don't know. Kind of weird angle. Not a great background. This is my fan I just got. Makes my life so much better because my room is freaking hot. And I think I'm just always hot in general. But I just got home and unloaded all of the groceries. But I thought that I would show you all the things that I got that weren't groceries. So first, I got this. I've been wanting one of these. Not necessarily this one, but um, 
one of the roller thingies and so I, got, I saw this one and it vibrates and it's got like this one that goes under your eyes too and oh it was twenty dollars but it was now nine dollars that's nice Hmm. And then I got this. I've really been wanting this. Um, so I got it. I like that this is not batteries. Like it, um, it goes on like a charging stand. But this one is so freaking cute. Isn't it so cute? I love it. Alright, anyways. Then I just got more mascara because I was out. And then I did find like a moisturizing body wash. But then I also found this. So this is a ultra moisture avocado oil body wash by Olay. And then this is a hydrotherapy wet skin moisturizer. Then I got more deodorant. I don't know what I'm going to do now. Like I said, I think I need to put this stuff away and then uh, go do the dishes. All right. Well, I'll keep y'all updated. We're not going to talk about the fit. All of my um, clean clothes are in uh, laundry baskets and I hate digging through them to try to find things to wear. So the fit will change once I do said laundry. Make coffee, that's all right. I don't know why I set you up. It's always debatable which size cup I want. Cause like, I, and I don't really know the differences. If you can't tell, my mom is obsessed with radon. She is one of those. I don't know what my choices in creamer are. For the first time ever, we don't have an abundance of creamer in the fridge like literally normally there's like two or three things in there and it's like why do we have this much creamer but today we have none apparently so we're gonna do almond milk and maybe a little bit of sugar i hate putting sugar in my coffee because i normally just literally do a dash of uh creamer but this is not sweet at all and i want a little bit of sweetness so we're gonna we're gonna have to figure something out Now I'm hungry. So this is probably not gonna be my best work, but it's fine. We're gonna make do with what we have. Also, if you see my crusty tattoo at any point in this video, I just got it touched up and it's like going through the peeling, scabbing process. I need to put some stuff on it, but <clears throat> yeah, if you see it, I'm not disgusting. It's just uh, fresh-ish. Oh yeah, y'all, I have my ring light in here, not for this reason, but because I was doing something yesterday and needed it. And it's just gonna work out in our favor. Okay, let's see. Oh, I feel like I don't want it to be blue either. Like I need this to auto adjust. Like what? Okay, maybe that's fine. Maybe I just won't get close to you. Oh my gosh, I just realized. Y'all can see my entire, please don't look at that, I'm sorry. It is a struggle to find, find Clean sheets around here, y'all. Or at least clean king size ones. I'm sorry, I just won't get it too close because that is that is harsh. I don't like it. I'm sorry that I look disgusting. I mean, hopefully this whole video I won't look like this, but I mean, no promises, I don't know. There's the bed, all made. I know I have a lot of pillows. I like it like that. All right, now we need to do something about all the rest of this. I will keep those lights up in my room until they die. I don't care if that's very 2015 of me. I like them and they make me feel festive year round.
So it was pretty much clean in here before I pulled out this stuff from my closet. So there's new stuff mixed in with this that I haven't worn. It just somehow got put in here that was in this bag. Some of the stuff I'm like setting aside because I'm going to Nashville for my 21st. And so I'm just trying to keep it all separated, but I think I'm gonna put it all away, but just have my Nashville stuff like in a separate part of my closet. Just at least it'll be out of the bag and off the floor. Um, and then eventually we can get ready halfway and not look like this for the rest of the video. Okay, little update. Hold on, let me move so it's not like a halo over my head. Um, so basically, as y'all saw, I had to do those clothes. I ended up doing them, but first my mom, well, long story short, my sisters called me. They were planning on surprising me with a party this weekend, but because um, my birthday is next Tuesday, and then they were like, well, it's a theme, so she'll probably want to pick out an outfit. So they ended up telling me, and then we left to go. They wanted me to help them pick out decorations of stuff that I liked and all that. So yeah, that's why I just like stopped the clip, clip abruptly because I got a call from my sister and all that went down. So we went to town, picked out some things for the party, and then I got a couple other things. Thought I'd just show you just to give you some extra content. I got this because I thought it was really cute. Then I got this planner. Um, I love the happy planners. This one was freaking cute. Like, let me just show you some of the pages. And it started at July, so I only missed like a month of it. I really liked the theme of all of these pages and stuff. So, yeah, really cute. And I needed a new one. And this one will last me until December of 2022. So, really liked it. This is random, but I got this box because it was $10. And I have like a keepsake box, but it's like an old Juicy Couture perfume box. And it's literally overflowing. And so I needed something new and bigger. Got all of the clothes put away. I'll show you what my closet looks like now. That's trash that I need to do something with. Um, bathroom, pretty clean. It wasn't really dirty to begin with. Closet is, y'all, it is just insane in here. No person should have this many clothes. I really need to do a closet clean out. Um, I've already kind of gone through my shoes. Like all of these I still pretty much wear. Uh, these are other people's clothes that I need to give back to them. So, and then over here, this random little section is clothes that, like, I put aside for Nashville. If you want to see, like, either either vlogs from that or just, like, outfits for that. I don't know, some type of thing. I will do that. And also, if y'all would be interested in seeing ooh, a closet clean out, let me know about that, too. Anyways, I am going to end the vlog so that way I can edit this and actually upload it. Um, I, like I said, I have that birthday party that was supposed to be a surprise this weekend. So, I might vlog that if y'all want to see that. And then, Tuesday is my actual birthday, like I said, August 31st. And, um, I'll be 21, so that's exciting. I have work Tuesday and Wednesday, like, all next week. So, nothing will probably actually go down on my actual birthday, but then next weekend maybe i'll get to do something actually being 21 because like my party obviously i won't be 21 yet i hope and pray that i can actually stick to this it's going to be a little difficult because of having a full-time job but uh i really do want to get back into this because i enjoy talking to a camera for some odd reason and just interacting with y'all in general so definitely leave me a comment no matter what it's about because i love replying but yeah, I guess I'll see y'all in my next video. Thank you for watching.